The first question is a stationary bus starts moving and attains a velocity of 10 meter per second. So there is a stationary bus. It starts moving. So starts moving any initial velocity is how much? 0 meter per second. Okay. And attains a velocity of 10 meter per second. Yani ki the final velocity is 10 meter per second. Okay. In one minute. So how much is the time in SI system? Time is measured in seconds. So the time will be one minute that is into 60 that is 60 seconds right we need to find the acceleration and displacement so we need to find a and s what is the formula of acceleration yes it is acceleration is rate of change of velocity so final minus initial velocity by time so that is 10 minus 0 by 60 which is 1 by 6, it can even be written as 0 0.167. So the acceleration is 0 0.167 meter per second square. Right? And we even need to find the displacement. So for that, we can use another formula. What is displacement? We can uh, use the formula x is equal to ut plus half at square or v square minus u square is equal to 2as. So let's use v square minus u square is equal to 2as. So what is s? s is v square minus u square by 2a. Right? So if it is used, I'll write it here. So it is s is equal to v square. That is how much is V? It is 10. So 10 square minus U square is 0 square by 2 and A. So what is A? A we have already obtained. I can write as 1 by 6. So it is 1 by 6. This is cancelled. 3 gets multiplied over to this 100. 10 square is 100. So 3 into 100. So S is equal to 300 meter. Right? The next question is Velocity of a car increases from 36 km per hour to 72 km per hour. So what is the initial velocity? Initial velocity is 36 km per hour. And what is the final velocity? It is 72 km per hour. But km per hour is not the SI system, SI unit. So I will have to convert it to meter per second for that. I will have to multiply it by either 1000 by 3600 or simplified form 5 by 18. Always remember, if you convert, if you want to convert velocity from kilometer per hour to meter per second, just multiply it by 5 by 18. So if I multiply this by 5 by 18, 18 twos are 36, so 5 twos are 10, so this is 10 meter per second. And if you convert this, if you this uh, multiply this by 5 by 18, you get it as 20 meter per second. So these are the initial and final velocities given. What is the time of change of velocity? It is 10 seconds. We need to find the acceleration. Very simple. Acceleration is V minus U by T. That is 20 minus 10 by 10. So that will be 10 by 10. How much is the acceleration? Yes, it is 1 meter per second square.